Elizabeth Holmes faces a hurdle in bid for a new trial as key witness stands by his testimony. Elizabeth Holmes' bid to get a new trial is on shaky ground after a witness who helped convict her stood by his testimony. I don't want to help Ms. Holmes, the witness, Adam Rosendorf, said. She needs to pay her debt to society. Holmes had requested a new trial after Rosendorf, Ferrano's former lab director, visited her home in August and suggested the prosecution twisted his words to make everybody look bad. Elizabeth Holmes is facing a setback in her efforts to get a new trial. On Monday, a witness at the center of one of her arguments for a legal do-over said he stood by the testimony he gave that helped convict the Theranos founder on fraud and conspiracy charges in January. Speaking at an evidentiary hearing in San Jose, California, Adam Rosendorf, a former lab director at Theranos, said, At all times I testify truthfully and honestly to the best of my recollection. I don't want to help Ms. Holmes, Rosendorf added. The only person that can help her is herself. She needs to pay her debt to society. The accuracy of Rosendorf's testimony had been thrown into question in recent weeks after he went to Holmes' home in August and allegedly expressed regret over what he said on the stand during her trial. Rosendorf allegedly spoke with Holmes' partner, Billy Evans, at the home. He said when he was called as a witness he tried to answer the questions honestly but that the prosecutors tried to make everybody look bad in the company, Evans wrote of Rosendorf in an email recalling the conversation between them. He said that the government made things sound worse than they were when he was up on the stand during his testimony. Holmes subsequently filed a motion seeking a new trial, and she was granted a small victory when the judge in her case allowed for an evidentiary hearing into whether there was prosecutorial misconduct surrounding Rosendorf's testimony. In the hearing Monday, Rosendorf clarified, at all times the government encouraged me to tell the truth and only the truth. He also explained that he'd tried to see Holmes in August because he felt distressed that Holmes' child, born last year, would grow up without a mother. Holmes faces up to 20 years in prison for each count on which she was found guilty. It is my understanding that Ms. Holmes may be pregnant again, Rosendorf said Monday. Neither Holmes nor her attorneys have publicly said if she is expecting a second child. During Holmes' trial, Rosendorf testified that he was asked to make up reasons other than test performance to explain unusual test results and that Theranos didn't have a formal proficiency testing protocol.